Okay, what's up everyone? So welcome to the final um, final part of the Lineage Revolution main quest line for patch 360. Since it's actually a final level is actually 360 here as well, so let's see how this um story will unfold or what conclusion will if Mal will be able to live through this or not. So let's do this. Finally, a ray of hope. Please go get a torch from Russell. Meanwhile, I'll take out the rest of the miners from the cocoons. Oh yeah, we're supposed to do some kind of rescue mission for these um cocoon victims. We need to move the corpses, we can't let them paint. It's so light, it must have been so distressed. A torch to cremate the remains? We're going to head out soon. If you want to leave quickly, it may be better to humor her. Hmm, here. Hurry back, alright? Come here, okay. I'm sorry, that's far too late. Yeah. We should begin the cremation right away. Apparently cremation is actually a common way of burying things here as well, in this universe. Ooh, what can I do? Is this Molly's decision? I had a quick look around and there are a lot of dying miners. We don't have time to cremate them all. We need to leave. But, since we can't just leave them here, we can at least end their suffering. How about it? Okay. Then mine will take care of the bugs nearby. Take care of what you need to. We don't have much time, so make it fast. Always become tougher. I wonder if this is a change for the better. It's a good direction to head in, considering her fate. Yep. For as a oh, magical creatures, so let's switch that one out. So since we have here the reincarnation of Shilin with us, which is Molly, so we'll wonder if we'll see the rest of the gods reincarnated as well. Especially, probably Saha would be nice to see as well what he's like. Maybe Ava too. The words are actually kind of not that great for the for our last part of the chapter, but well, hopefully it will be something better at the later episodes. Be careful of the suffering earth spirit. They will attack any passerby. Molly doesn't seem to have any cautiousness, so we should be prepared just in case. Death grade, really? Sheesh. Yep, magical creatures as well, nice. So for these things, they drop... Oh yeah, Talisman Elves. Okay. Yeah, I think so. Uh, actually, we're going to get a UR Magical Bow here. Since for these mobs, are actually it goes down in just maybe 2 or 4 average hits. So that's a good thing for those who's actually farming in the open fields. Special these magical creatures. Okay, there we go. Light crossbow, huh? Dang. Blue part and blue part three. Okay. Same goes for the crazy worms descendant. They're very dangerous, so defeat them before they create more trouble. Fair enough. So, I don't think they're magical creatures, so we go back to our normal weapon. It means we're getting closer to it after the dialogue. Oh well. So swarm like things again with four, four mouths, or four mouth pieces or something. Not sure how do you call them. Or pedals, whatever. Ooh, ball turn hard. Too bad I can't do it since I'm recording. So for these things, they drop. Oh yeah, them up here. Okay. So I think we already fought these things a little while ago, or it's part of the line earlier. So we have to fight them again, no?
Okay, done. So what next? Infected uh, peeps. Okay. What the? The corpse is moving. What is this? Let's hurry up. What more corpses? So necromancy again. Is this a trace of dark magic? Are the Dark Brotherhood nearby? Apparently so. Ah, the smell. Ah, infected corpses. Okay. My goodness, it's horrendous. I really don't like this place. Ah. Okay, that's a surprise. No bosses here. Yes, grade pain feeling. Don't need that. Evidence of intelligence. There's that dark guy. Just as I thought. It's the Dark Brotherhood. So, what do we do next? So, okay, that's for quest. Ha ha ha, you're pretty damn slow. I should have ta just taken some um, nap while waiting. Anyway, it must mean that we're almost there and that the Dark Brotherhood are nearby. Of course, of course. It also means this is your last stop. Heard that before. Okay, are we fighting? Yep, we are. Okay. Okay, have a meteor and a missile bolt for your troubles. What? You guys are too strong. It looked like Ankle gave me wrong information. I'm out of here. Good luck. Oh. Anyway, what are you doing with that shell of a person? Is it a requirement to be a chatty Jeff to join the Dark Brotherhood? Um, being chatty is proof of high intellect, you dumb orc. Okay. <laughs> Provocative, aren't you? Anyway, so quite a quick fight. He's running away. Get him! Whoa, Tygoon, be careful. Those Dark, dark brother pests uh, don't just run away. It might be a trap. You have to be careful since we're there wily. Okay, so we must cut it off here. We don't know what other wicked plan they'll enact next. And there's that lagging again. And we got trapped. Here we are, huh? What's going on? Haha, you've stepped into the trap to the dimension of prison you go. Again, bye-bye, double. And orc. Okay. I think we've already had been through dimensional prisons, maybe let's see, there's one on Devil's Isle. Then I think on the early chapters there's two. So I think four or five or so if I remember correctly. Ah, damn it. Where the hell is this place? Um looks like the experience dungeon, but anyway, let's see what we do here. Oh, episode clear, okay. I think I'll just make it just one big episode for everything. Okay, and let's first check what our next reward will be looking like. That will be at the end of the chapter then, okay. So, two more chapters to go. So for this chapter we're looking at... Um, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Eleven quests, okay. For the Earth Dragon's Prison. Earth Dragon Prison, okay. Anyway, let's just get to it. No, then. Russell was right. We should have been more careful. Now what do we do? I hear a sudden noise. This voice sounds familiar. There's someone nearby. Could it be... Kuen Chinaka? What a relief. Molly's not here. These corpses. How long have they been here? Have you been attacked as well? That's not important. Must escape here. I'll tell you how. We must defeat servants of Devian. Okay. Typical. Maybe we'll use their blood again to... To some some kind of portal. The Earth Dragon expelled their prisoners here to the dimensional prison and keep them captive. The two prison guards must be defeated in order to believe this place. Same condition as like any other dimensional prisons. So let's see. These are the minions they must be defeated too. Okay. You must defeat Deviant's right hand man. Okay. I don't want to stay here, but oh well. So they're undead. The Vivian's underling must be defeated first. Five only, huh? Okay. At least it's not the 20, so... So this should be a quick quest then. Okay, nicely and done. Okay, prison guard of the Earth Dragon prison... Uh, what? Prison redundancy boys. Now you must defeat the Vivian. Sorry, I can't help. There's Deviant. I'll protect Gwen so don't worry and go. 
Okay. Oh my god, that's one big move. Big and easy to kill. So yeah. Quite tough, aren't you? I like that. Oh, absurd. Greenhorn. Haha. -ha. Okay, short dialogue there, so... But that's done. So, to part 3 we go. What should I do next? You must defeat Lumera's minions. Okay, 5 again please. 5? Nice, okay, 5. Okay, so next, put Dragon's Prisoner Part 4. Must I defeat the Lumera's minions again? You can defeat the Servant of Lumera. Okay, have those things. So I guess they only make it 5 because this map is so freaking small for an experienced dungeon, so yeah, I'll go. You'll be able to leave it to us. I don't know. What? Oh come on, please leave with us. It's very rare that we have an allied dragon these days, or ever in the game since. That dragon's okay, done. Time for you to defeat the prison guard Lumero now. The one who defeats the prison guard becomes the prison guard. Prison guards have the authority to release prisoners. Speak of the devil. I think they sense us and they're coming this way. Lenma, come this way. Okay. Last wave already, and yep, yet another easy kill. Does look like Marsha. Stop, you spare me. My tax is prevent pr prisoners from leaving. And I find killing prisoners quite fun. Yeah, right. Okay, so now that we've done that. How did you complete the Rattel quest? Tell quest simply just camp at the extra at the extraction dungeon. So once they spawn, you have a chance to, for them to drop. Otherwise, you stay there till one of them drops it eventually. Okay, start the quest. I'll try trusting you. Defeat that. Defeated. The time must have passed a lot already. You must get out of here quickly. Do you know what to do? Relax. Time here passes faster than the other than the outside world. Take the essence of dimension from the corpse of the prison guard. Okay. Okay, so where's our exit? Oh, okay. Let's run this lady over here. Wait a minute, what? Why did he even do that? It's time to return. Bring the essence of dimension. Aren't you coming with us? Two essences means that only two leave. I am the prison guard. Oh, come on. Seriously? We'll make sure to come back for you. Draconians do live for a very long time, but your hope is misplaced. I fear I will not live long enough to benefit from your help. Hmm. Protect Molly. Protect Antharas. The honorable draconians should not continue living as Belek slaves. Go, flame warriors. It is an honor to fight along, fighting alongside you. Great. That's probably the shortest something that we relationship have with a dragon, but yeah. Fine. I hate the writers of this game. Oh well. Okay, back in business. Whoa, you scared me. That was so out of nowhere. Okay, more beads for us. Yeah, nothing that we need. Okay, start the quest What's again. Going on? I thought your your friend was following the Dark Brotherhood, but it lost track. What happened? I just came back from a short yet long trip. I see Ankle Vanguard o over there. I'm assuming they are trying to stop Molly from getting to the Earthworm. It will almost be impossible to obtain the Earthworm essence with peace if Ankle awakens the Earthworm. Defeat Ankle before he breaks the seal that uh, keeps keeping Earthworm at sea. We must defeat Ankle the Vanguard first. Okay. Seriously, rune stones at this level of the quest? Come on. 
And we're back to our 20 kills again. So for these Anku Vanguard, they drop runes from the worst of this mob. So that's why there's um, no one actually farming these mobs here. Boy, almost done. Then again, since there's actually less people farming here, maybe I'll AFK farm here someday. And more, a lot more people actually just some farming the magical creatures or so. Okay. Okay, start quest. Seems like the ankle earth dragons are focusing on something else over there. They're not even looking at us. Something is weird. We should investigate this. Alanma, you should um could you defeat the ankle bibliographer? What? Okay, dragons read books. Okay, interesting. Meanwhile, I'll check it out to see what's going on. Yeah, right. I do the grunt work while you do the scouting thing, huh? Okay, um, so, oh yeah. So they said um, ankle bibliographer, but they're actual ankle undoers, huh? So I think someone mistranslated again. And they actually don't drop anything. Okay, fine. So let's see. They're not dropping anything, so I think they'll be adding maybe, maybe ad additional jewelry or something down the future. Or maybe some fish for the professor in dungeon, maybe. Well, can't say for sure. So I can kill Doratel and get to the drop that is. Yep. That marble RNG for you. It has a good chance to drop. I think it took me 10 kills on uh, one of my on my blade dancer to get it. So yeah. Okay, done, and we got a level up as well for our conquer rewards. Okay, there we go. So moving on. I don't have much knowledge on magic, but this obviously looks like it has something to do with disabling the barrier of, of Earthworm. We should destroy this right away. Destroy what now? Okay, destroy the crystals. For a quest like this, they should have more channels, which is, yeah, I know. Oh, behind me? Okay. What's behind me? Another ambush, okay, fine. I've run into an enemy. That's not an enemy, tons of enemies actually. Report to Mokon, the mana flow device has been broken. Okay, Mokon, so we have an NPC name here, so I think he's uh, like the engineer here for these crystals. Okay, continue again. Hopefully that interfered with whatever they're working on. Now let's join the party. What happened? We re received word that the barrier removal was stopped. So we need to Molly. Okay, there she is. That thing had something to do with the earthworms barrier disappearing, huh? 
It's a relief that it's useless now, but we'll come face to face with the ankle elite soldiers soon. We should strike first. We're almost at the earthworm's nest now. So why did what do we do if the earthworm rampages after we've collected its essence? If it does, unspeakable things will happen. I don't think some I don't think it it's think of something, but come on, Russell, out with it. Okay, probably the next quest line. So let's just check our map here on how much more that we need to go through. Okay, I think this is already the last part since we've been through here, 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 then here. So yeah, I think this should be the final place. And like this, it, oh wait, actually just dropped the four, fine. So there's the Mokan that was still talked about earlier. Those rats have made the thing so tedious. Ah, stop right there, I'm going to go get them. Come and get it then. Let's hurry out of, out of here, come back. Okay, found them, they're over there. So, we've got another ambush to deal with. Keep them restrained, we're almost there. We'll deal with these fools. Strike first. Okay. Wait a minute. Mokon's familiar spirit, huh? That looks like a magical creature. And there's Mokon himself. Easily killable. We're the ones who will die. Ah, missed the dialogue again. Hello. And that concludes that episode. I think that's episode 9. Sorry, okay, nice. Okay, let's continue. The final episode it is. Yep, good. No level requirement. <laughs> of course, there shouldn't be. So, start quest. It's time to enter the earthworm's nest. I'll split up around here for a moment and bring... Bring my fear some point pit. Now that's uh, the time to use the teleportation stone that you received from Priest Ida. Please install the stone of return on where I will be returning. I'll teleport where the point thief with the point thief when we are ready. Good idea. We don't know what to expect when the earthworm awakens. Is this where earthworm anyway? So from what they're saying, I don't think it's Antharas, but well, we'll see. I was thinking it would be better to bring Mafir's, uh, the Mafir's point if and initiate the ritual to recover Holy Sanctity right here. Will it be possible? I'm just... Believe in yourself, Molly. I will do my best to bring the point if. I'll protect Molly with my life, not only for the Kingdom of Flame, but for the good of men. Ooh, he's dedicated. Oh well. Depart to the Earthworm's Nest. Let's come back as fast as we can. Okay, this is it. Final chapter, final episode, whatever you may want to call it. Let's see, Shillin's Flame Warrior. Okay, I like the title. What? Okay, there's a portal here. That's for the next patch, maybe. Um, patch 400, maybe, or something like that. Hello? To the Earthworm's Nest. Uh, okay, got a green card here. They've arrived. Attack! It's Shillin's reincarnation. Stop her from approaching. Step aside. If you don't, I'll show no mercy. Yeah, that's really an awful lot of mobs right now. Hmm. All the pest does is stop. Let's hurry and just wipe them out. Okay, there we go. Deep in the mines, where the heck are we? Let's see. Oh, no world map available, fine. So so that's why it's actually a dead end for that part. There's actually like a new quest only map then, huh? Okay, fine. This place is dangerous. I see the two barriers that were used to put the earthworm to sleep. 
sleep right over that bridge. Okay, it looks like those bastards got there before us. We must break through this area quickly. Let's go. Okay. Another escort mission. Yep, it is. Stop them from crossing the bridge! Not a chance. Ooh, it's Ankle himself now. Okay. Okay, damn it, the Hectors got this far. Okay, we have not Dark Brotherhoods. Yonise, it's them, or uh, kill them. Make sure they don't call for support. Jeez, look at all these waves. There's actually nearly endless of them. Okay, done. Finally. Hey, I forgot to check how many uh, missions or quests we have here, so might as well check now. Okay, two, four, six, eight. Okay, eight missions only, or eight quests. Okay, so this should be a short one then. This place is I secured the first barrier. The magic here is quite stable. I should install the Stone of Return right here for Rustle. They won't just uh, stand there and watch. Let's defeat those Dark Brotherhood guys over there in case they attack us from behind. Uh huh. Damn it, we're stranded. We're toast if we stay like this. We're done for. If the Earthworm awakens, we need to retreat. So yeah, so far we actually haven't seen Velot or even Embryon here. Those are um, top brass of the Dark Brotherhood. So if they actually don't show up here at all, well that's a big surprise. Anyway, let's see what happens next. And yeah, Amtaris is still missing in action for ever for this um for L2R at all, so we'll see if he will be here. Now that place looks settled, help me install the stone of the turn. Okay. We're almost there. Just a little more help. Russell will arrive in this area when the preparations are complete. Buy him some time, please. Ankle, it seems the fools are calling support. I'm calling in support for Strather. Okay. What? We're watching. Were you watching idly by while this was taking place? You idiot. Stop them immediately. Okay. Oh boy, that's an awful lot of dragons again. Actually, I have my dragon weapon already upgraded though. Russell and the punch will be here any moment, just withstand them a little more. So that means we'll be expecting maybe one or two more movies here. Yep, more dragons, oh boy. So we'll save the meter and the missile boat for Ankle himself. I think we'll be fighting him eventually. Okay. Looks like the summon is commencing and they're all here. Russell, Urian, and Aida. Okay. Russell has returned. Ha ha ha. Okay. Cast recall. Nice name. Out a little. Oh no, what are the, these guys doing here? They're trying to awake the Earthworm. We must stop them. We must obtain the Earthworm essence right now, before the Earthworm awakens. A point there. The situation is more serious than I thought. I'll begin the ritual to extract the Earthworm essence. Okay, so that's why we need them here. And I will initiate the ritual to recover Molly's sanctity along with it. Priest Ida, let's begin right now. Right away, point there. Molly, please come this way. Tiger and Russell, please stop them from interfering with us. Please help the ritual and make sure to protect us from the enemy from interfering with us as well. Okay, now let's begin. Okay, the final brawl to bra the mother of all brawls, then rather. Openings here of empty. What? Okay. All my underlings died over there by the barrier. One of the spears of emptiness has been opened. The earthworm's energies will gather around the sphere of emptiness once the other sphere is open. Okay. Kill Molly, that's the only way. Oh yeah, screw you. They're coming across the bridge. Protect Molly. 
we nah, let's not sell shots here. Buy us a little more time, okay? This is it. Let's get ready to rumble. So, ankles nowhere in sight just yet, so let's just kill whatever. Deal with them in hurry. Okay, one dark brotherhood there, have a machine gun, or dragons as usual. Wow, these things are tough. But they're normal creatures though. So yeah, still have the, the normal bow here. Okay, last one. Nope, okay, here's the last wave. And I still don't see Ankle here or anywhere. Okay, one more Dark Brotherhood. Okay, that went pretty well. So, commercial for now. Eh, just kidding. Let's just continue. Okay, sure look up. It. What? Damn. Damn it, we can't put off any longer. Just destroy the barrier, just awake the earthworm right... He lost his mind. Oh well, anyway. That bastard is crazy. My thoughts exactly. It's safe here. Stop ankle now. Okay. Wow, that's the dragon, okay. He's also in chains, or... Wait a minute, that's not a dragon, it's like a huge plant. Break this barrier now, I said. This is too da dangerous. If the barrier breaks and the earthworm awakens, it, uh, it'll it suck out all of our soul. Wait, what? Arg, you dim with Egalon? Get rid of um, him immediately. Arg, will you... Uh, what? Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm going to do this my way. Ow, that hurts. And there's another rare instance where the my ulti didn't work. Dang it. I think we can just go kill him anyway. Have you tried to how to shove your face in the dirt first, rookie? Oh boy, that looks like it hurts, so step away. Bygoon ankles attempting to break the barrier. Almost done here. <laughs> Out of the way, lizard. Okay, there's our movie. No! Oh my gosh. He really is gonna awaken it, huh? Okay, I think we did we made it. The great earthworm has awakened. <laughs> now you will all die. Idiot finally crossed the line. So that's the earthworm, huh? Well, that's definitely not a Taurus, so okay. So, this is how it ends. Come on, let's see some chill and action now. Okay, there we go. Wow, that's a pretty long movie. My child, you have been tormented by the seal. I shall call upon you on the judgment day. For now, heal your scars within the abyss. Okay. Wait a minute, so she basically like sent it over to the underworld? Wow. I think it's safe to assume she's got this her power back, but then we will see them. I've got another conquer level. Okay. I'll try this is yes, that's right. That is Shillin's the reincarnation has regained its sanctity. Nice. It's too dangerous to be near the earthworm. Please move to a safer area. Okay, teleport with Molly. Okay, I guess it's over.
ankle. Now that I think about it, I don't see that fool anywhere. Ran out of the nest as soon as the earthworm fell back asleep. I'll let him be, as he was unfit to join death. Hmm, seems like he's rather talented at running away. Molly, you're not any different, but you're not quite the same either. This is... I'm still Molly, Tygon. Oh, reincarnation of Shilin, please. The earthworm. You know what will happen when the earthworm awakens. Don't worry. The earthworm has to return to its nest. It won't terrorize the town any longer. Thank you. Wow, it's true. Molly really is the reincarnation of Shilin. I was skeptical. Tygon, I couldn't return Fargo's fire. I'm sorry. Ah, nothing we can do about it now. Don't worry too much about it. I'm sure there's another way. Now let's get get back to Magda then, Molly. I'm most probably waiting for you. Will you go on ahead without me? I must stop I must stop by somewhere first. Don't worry, Belt won't be controlling Antaras. Okay. Oh alright, let's do that. Ha <laughs> ha okay. Daigun, what are you planning to do now? Will you be returning to the Kingdom of Flame? Let us go to Magnadin. I would like to meet the leader of the Silverlight Mercenaries. Oh, will you be coming with us? I now know the future of the Kingdom of Flame doesn't rest solely on Tagro's fire. The problems of the Orc Kingdom stem from other things too. I must admit that traveling with you helped me realize this. Now I'm very curious about the Silverlight Mercenaries. Ha ha ha, you're welcome anytime, okay? I suppose this is where we go, all go our separate ways then. Thank you for everything. Lenma, Ida, the Pointy, Russell, and... Tygoon. Let's go, Russell. Where are we headed again? Magnadin. Okay. Magnadin it is. So with that, so we do have now the reincarnation of Shellen in the Silverlight Mercenaries, but well, Belleth and Embryon is still nowhere in sight. Okay, meet Russell again. Okay. Deeds, really? That's so that's so bummer. Anyway. Let's see if this place must this be magnetic. How surprising. A floating city. That is the headquarters of our Silverlight mercenaries. Now let's go. I'll introduce you to Hardin. Okay. Everyone will be pleased to see you. I can't wait already. Teleport is an Abela what? Start quest. Okay, let's go. But to recover Molly's essence, ah, just the dialogue again. They may integrate as far as to why we returned without Molly. My mission is to stop Bellet. Bring Molly back is only part of the, that mission. Okay. If you fight alongside us, that mission will be complete. Aha, is that so? Okay. Arden, Theodore, we've completed our mission. Great job, Russell. Hmm, Molly seems to be missing. Who is the guest you brought with you? I'm sorry for their late introduction. I'm Taigun Zehestui. I met your mercenaries on the Immortal Plateau and have come to here to join the Silverlight mercenaries. That name, Hardin, that is the extolled member of the Hestui, the envoy of the flame. The reputation precedes you around these parts. It's a great honor to have you join us. Where's Molly? Was the mission a success? Russell, Elena, okay. Ah, where where do we even begin? I should probably do do the explaining. I agree. Tygun, please go ahead. Hey Tygun, what's taking so long? There were many complications along the way, but Molly was able to recover Shillin's power. She couldn't join us as there's a place she wanted to stop by along the way. She also said not to worry about Antares. What a relief. I was worried. Thank you for all your hard work, Tygun. You too, Russell Elena. Okay. We'll be able to use this information to get more lords to join the alliance. I'll I'll get quite busy, Theodore. Anything else to report? Yes, there is. The gr that great worm, what's its name? Ah, the earthworm. Terrasken. Okay, that's the first time I've heard that name. It had awakened, but Molly was able to put it back to sleep after she recovered her powers. But the dwarven barrier is broken. That would prove that she's indeed recovered Shilin's powers. Arden, we'll need to keep an eye on the Spine Mountains. Yes, as long as Belt retains Shillen's power, there's no guarantee that the Earthworm will stay out of his control. We should also prepare to reseal Terrasken when we really, when we rally the Lords to the Allied Army. Tygun Russell Lenma, you've gone through a lot during your journey. Take this opportunity to rest until the next call. Russell, I'm entrusting you to show Tygun around Magdadin and introduce him to the... Leave it to me, okay? Do we hit the pub first? 
<laughs> you understand me so well, let's go, okay. Um, what? Okay, there we go. And that completes the episode. Episode cleared. So yeah, that's um... Yeah, that's barely any action from the Dark Brotherhood. No Embryon or... Or Belleth, so... Probably be on the next episode or something. So, okay, let's just finish this up then. And still the biggest mystery is where... What did Nolly do in them? So, here we go again. So 23 episodes, so let's just get the quests or the rewards. I think it's just red diamonds anyway. Okay, 210 red diamonds, not so bad for a reward I guess. Okay, so all the quests complete. Okay, so that's it. So that concludes the main quest line or the main storyline of Lindy True Evolution patch 360. Whereas Molly, I have no idea, but well, we'll probably see it on the future patch as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this segment and this conclusion of the storyline, and thank you guys for watching, I'll see you guys next time then. Peace guys!